Hello and welcome to a video tutorial showing you how to install themes onto your sidekick. Um, before we get started, we're going to need a couple of things. Um, you're going to need an SD card. Uh, one came with your phone. If you have the one that came with it, that's fine. If you bought a new one, that's fine as well. You'll also need a USB cable, the one that came with your phone. Again, that's fine. If you don't have one, a lot of digital cameras these days will use the same kind of um, connector. So if you have that, that's fine as well. So before we get started, we're going to want to make sure that you pick the right website to use. If you have a Sidekick LX, you'll of course use sklxthemes.com. If you have a Sidekick Slide, you'll use sklidethemes.com. If you have a Sidekick 3, you'll use sk3themes.com. And if you have a Gecko or 2008, you'll use sk08themes.com. So now that we're ready for you to start uploading a theme, you're going to want to pick a theme, of course, from the plenty of themes available on the website for your specific device. I, myself, in particular, the themes created by Prash, so that's what I'm going to be using in this demonstration. So once you found a theme that you like, I like this geek theme that Prash has created, you can hover over and see a preview of it. And if you like it, you can click on the download button at the bottom of the theme and download it to your computer. Once you click on the download button, it will ask you if you want to save or open the file. Click on the save button. Once it asks you where you want to save the file, choose to save it to your desktop. It's just a little bit easier to do during this tutorial. Uh, just click the save button once you have your desktop selected. Once the file has been downloaded to your computer, just click the close button. And then if you chose choose, you can close Internet Explorer. Right click on the file we saved to your desktop before and choose the extract all option in the menu that pops up. Once you've done that in this dialog window that comes up, click the extract button at the bottom of the window and let the files extract to your desktop. Once the file has finished extracting, the folder will open containing the theme that you just downloaded. If you double click on this folder, you should see all the images that make up the theme and a text file. Just leave everything alone. Just make sure that that is how the folder is laid out. Click on the back arrow and go back to the folder that we were just in. Now you're going to want to plug in your Sidekick. If you're plugging it in via USB, just plug in the USB cable. Or if you're plugging in a memory card reader, plug in the memory card reader now. Once the computer is done reading your memory card, at the bottom of this window that pops up, it will say Open Folder to View Files. Choose that option. At the top of the window, click on the Organize button and then click on New Folder. Once it creates the new folder, you're going to want to call it Themes, capital T-H-E-M-E. 
ES and then click off on the folder to name it. Double click on the folder and then you're going to want to have an empty folder. Drag in that folder from the theme that you downloaded and let that copy over to your SD card. Once that's done copying, double click on the folder and make sure that that folder contains just images and that one text file. At this point, you can go back and repeat the process as many times as you like for as many different themes as you would like. Once you are done com copying over all the themes, just close all the windows, unplug the device from your computer, and go to the menu and choose your theme. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. Hopefully this has helped you install themes to your phone. If you have any questions, please just drop us an email and we will try and help you out as best as we can. Thank you for watching.